No. Nah. Dude, you, you, you gotta have to try and dig out of the shit, man. That's the only, I mean, that's a big fucking hole. And it's probably- I not, think, I, dude, I, I, I think, I think the only, I don't have another option. Like, I don't have an option of someone to come in and to, to relieve my debt. I don't have an option. I don't have an option. You know what? Not, not that I don't have. I don't want. I don't want someone to come in and relieve all my debt. I don't want someone to just wipe it away. I want to dig myself out of this the hard fucking way, like the most embarrassing way possible. That's what I need. I need it to blow up. I need it to hurt. I need it to sting. And like, I need to feel that that shame to put it in perspective like the good like you know what i've done because what got me here is not what's going to get me out of here like no you gotta money, you gotta get humble making dude. money getting famous all that shit that's not going to get me out of what i did like, i'm not going to be able to talk my way out of it i'm not going to be able to like you know convince my way out of the fact that i owe people money but that's what got me in this position was fame and a little bit of success. So I need to go through it the hard way, but like, do you know what I'm going to commit to right now is I'm just going to fucking tell everybody straight up. Like, I'm $5 million in debt. I, I've been a complete fucking degenerate and I was like focused. I saw, saw, I, I saw a little, I got a little bit of taste of success in the stars and I thought that would never end. And for the last two years, that, that's how I've lived my life, is that it would never end. I was way too good at what I did. I was way too famous, way too popular. I was, I was the leader of all of this in the industry, and I let that, like, kind of tank me, so. I mean, dude, I think, uh, I think you getting honest and getting humble is probably the the best thing you could do on a, on 